Yeah, I'm surprised I was able to do that without straw matter. Oh, we got no area for Pokemon. I really want to win some prize money. Sure. You, this little fuckhead. This little fuckhead. Okay, accidentally one shot him. Look yourself, gotta hold back a little bit. This little fuckhead! That's gonna hurt. Oh no, it won't. Um, interesting. So he's got a move that's not very effective bubble, and then he's got a move that looks like Bubble Bean that is super effective. Whatever, I'm catching him. I'm catching him. You're getting put on the team, kid. Freaking Gumble. Gumble out of the- it's hard on the outside, but becomes more chewy when exposed to liquids such as rain. Nicknamed a Gumble? No. No. Won't give it to you. I don't want one of you. You just look annoying. And it, it learned Sonic Boom early on, but Sonic Boom's almost already ran its course. So it's basically just offering up the Pokemon that we're at the- WHAT THE FUCK?! Basically just offering up the Pokemon that we're already at the gym. But now. Didn't think I would crit. Whatever, I wanted the level. Strawmander evolving? Oh shit, Strawmander evolving. Uh, that's ought to be good. What a skinny neck. Congratulations, your Strawmander evolved into Strawmalian. See, I want to look at the type chart to get advantages when I need them or whatever, but... But... I don't know the typings of most of the Pokemon yet, so I'm either not going to really understand this fully until I get, like, way, way more into it. In fact, it's probably just going to be like that. I probably just won't understand it until I get way, way more into it. With this, Yo, Insane Phoenix, thing in nine months. Containing the ultimate power. Chaos... Control. Look at the right starter, Kappa. Whatever you just said. Oh, are you just happy we picked Charmander? I want to catch a Mintrit. I'm sure its typing will be garbage, because Centrit's normal, so this will probably be vanilla, but... Who knows? I want to catch a Mintrit. A common candy that is known for its ability to keep things clean. Its colors are pretty decorational. Mitchell, it seems nice considering we're just coming off Christmas season. Alright, we're gonna look at some of the Pokemon we just caught. Check their typing out. See if we wanna put them on the team, because if we look, our Meowthans are doing jack fucking shit, except this one. But, the Meowthan game, the pickup game, was not nearly as strong as I had hoped, so, kinda getting shafted in that department. It just looks like a fucking balloon. Gentle nature, don't show, don't know which one that is. Cherry type, so that would have been the type of Bulbasaur. Oh, sturdy! What a good ability. And right now it knows bubble, which is apple type. Pounds. What the fuck is soften? User stiffens all the muscles in its body and body and raises its defense stat. That's not what softening is. It's the opposite of softening. That's like it Oh, because it's hardened. Because it's just the move Harden. He just flipped it for no reason. Um, but I know he learns a move that's super effective against strawberry types. I think we're putting Gumble on the team. Let's also see what's up with Mintrit. What type of nature is gentle? Anybody know? Off the top of the head? Sassy nature. Keen eye. Eh, it sucks. It knows Peck. The great type move. Wait, what type is it? Oh, it's just vanilla. I'll leave Sentry. I ain't gonna fuck with no vanilla type. We don't fuck with these vanilla Poke Sweets out here. Nobody knows? That's great. Um, alright, I'm gonna put him on. You just picked something up, so I'm gonna leave you be. And now we got a gumball.
Dino Vegito, two things. Number one, that's not how you spell that. Number two, the typing is all fucked up. It's just because one move is one way it doesn't mean the other flying type move won't be a different type. Now, I wonder how well Gumball would do against all their shit. Check Straw Million? Why? His moves didn't change. His type didn't change. Nothing's different. I'm not going through that gym again, so let's just let's put Gumball up front, even though we kind of still need to level up Thunder Shat more. We need to level up Pops at you more, too, but whatever. Um, I could put them both up front. They kind of make a weak team, though. I'm going to leave Lickerita up front for now, because even though Straw, Million, eh. Lickerita is going to evolve soon, and I'm excited for that, but Straw Million is a starter. Straw Million needs to be the top level. <clears throat> hey, I saw you in Flower Forest. I'll catch a Colton back at it again. Two cotton hats. All right. Ooh, bubble hits both. Cool. I'm here for that. I don't think Apple Claw is good against either, but I'll try it. No, I'm not good against either. Bubble sucks. As long as they keep going after Straw Manor, I will just go back to Pokemon Center and heal up after this, but Gumble should level up pretty quickly off these. What the fuck? You got a Cotton Moth already? This is bad. Okay, goodbye, Gumble. Gave it a good run. Orange Shock, these guys. Please don't have another Pokemon. Good. This thing's level 18. Wait a second. What are you doing out here being level 18? Not Confection. Not on Thundershot. Okay, he took it, but he's confused. Don't do it. Okay, Orange Shock. Orange Shock, not very effective, but we got the Paralysis off. Ember, actually not very effective. I'm gonna leer it and scratch it. Okay, you can't keep doing that. No, Thundershot's down. So it turns out we are kind of... Why did, did it... Shed, does it have Shed Skin? Why did its paralysis go away? Help, I'm upset. They really meant for us to train up in this gym, didn't they? Straw Million! Okay, this game a little bit tougher than I expected. Not gonna lie. Hey, Meowthin learned Bite, though. I might keep this Meowthin around, this level 10 one. We might wind up keeping this Meowth around. I'm gonna keep cracking at this route. Maybe we just got unlucky with this first battle. But, uh... That's also a full evolution. It was level 18, so it was two levels up on both my best Pokemon. And it's a full Evo. Even if it's a bug type, it's a full Evo. Really early on. I think they do genuinely expect you to grind up on these gyms, but honestly, the typing I had just is not good for grinding up on these gyms. It's gonna be really hard to level up Gumball like this. He's silent. Oh, this guy. Okay. These things fucking miss me. I think you do well at the Coliseum. Sure, whatever that is. Can I fuck with a Mintrit? No, Mintrit's vanilla, so Bubble won't be super effective. Let's just get out of here. I will say, there being as many double battles as there are does make training up a little bit easier. I wonder what's a good taunt. How was she talking? Trying to think of ways to talk shit? Bug Catcher James. Cook it to. Wow, more fully of. Wait, more full Evos. Why? Little Gumball's level 6, man! I think I'm another lost cause here. See if I can hunger dust this one while we work on the other one. All right, it worked, dope. Now we're gonna pull one down while the other one eats himself. That's just how we fucking roll. Probably would've been smart on Hunger Dust, the one that we're on. Oh, it no Shed Skin! Why do they all know Shed Skin? Fucking Lickerita went down, goddammit. Time to bust out some orange shocks. Gumble got a level, though. Look at little Gumble. Gumble got a couple levels. Gumble learned Disable. Look at Gumble getting games. 
Not very big gains, but gains. Thunder Shack got a level. Cookie Tune doing that damage. Orange Shock. Not awful. Better than how Orange Shock normally does, so. Please stop going after Charmeleon. Okay. Charmeleon got a level. Man, this is. It is tough in these streets. They got fully evolves already. Done like dinner. They're coming at my neck with fully evolves already. Uh, are there any trainers over here? Can I just. Do I have a clean run of the Poke Center? I have a clean run, though. I didn't have to go all the way back. Wait a minute. This cave is not in the spot where the cave. Wait, are you Magikarp guy? Team Sour attacks Candy Manor. Repelled by Dentist. Wait, what? They should print what actually happened. How did Dentist still. Dentist still got his dumbass name in the paper. Wait, why? How did Dentist still get away with that one? Carry six Poke Sweets at once. Always have a full team. Yeah, yeah, you got it. Right, Twelve flavors of Poke Sweets. My favorite is strawberry. Well, strawberry sucks. Newsflash. Dentist is a bastard. Wait, so there's two. Got something to the left and something to the white. Right. Rock candy mines. Ouch, I tripped over a gumble. Is this the Coliseum? Sorry, I can't talk. I'm prepping for the battle. Is this Pokemon Contest? What is this? Welcome to the Vanilla Dome. If you can survive for four battles in here, you'll win a prize. But be warned, your team does not recover between bouts. Would you like to enter? Yes? Okay, take your spot and wait for your first opponent. You might be thinking I'm first just to wear you down. That's just silly. Let's fight. He has four Pokemon. What did I get myself into? Oh, this is... Nope, nope. Not winning this one. You know what? We'll come back here later. I don't need this negativity in my life right now. We'll come back later. That's when we'll come back. I'm healing up just at the side of that. I think there's another trainer down here. I might be able to battle. Better take a rest. Groan. That tunnel takes a lot. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to do that tunnel now. What we're not going to do is that fight back in there. Because there's just something... You never just show up and you're just like, Oh, yeah. See, I'm not ready for this. Sometimes in life you show up and you just know, right? If I have to take an extra trip through this tunnel, through this cave, I'll buy more repels. I'll do it. To come back and do that when all my Pokemon are level 20 or something. Am I doing it right now? Fuck the fuck. Nope. I wouldn't go further. Some shady thugs have taken over. How are their Poke Sweets so donut strong? Coming on at me. Oh my god, my first TM. Bullet Mint. I doubt TMs are reusable. I'm gonna treat it like they aren't. User sh it's a lime type attack. User shoots mints at the foe. Two to, two to five mints are shot at once. Lickerita can learn it. I don't know how much better it is than Absorb, all in all. But Okay! Wait, we got a little Q pop in here? It's not weak to bubble. Or apple type. Probably grape type. Judging everything based on the looks. A little Q pop in here? It fights with rock solid lollipops. It licks them when it wants to st stick them in foe's hair to annoy them. What the fuck? Mintonite. Mint. 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 Mintonite. Mint. Mintonite. Mintonite. Are you weak to apple? Yes, you are. You are also Apple! Ow! What the fuck? Alright, so, uh, we're gonna get you with a different Pokemon. Will you live this? Okay, good shit. Alright, we're gonna peep the, <clears throat> peep the typing on, typings on these guys. It uses a large, swirly mint as a shell. It's a combination of cherry and lime. Licking it is good for one's breath. Suspicious men are in the cave. What about you? You think I'm suspicious, bug catcher Kent? All right, uh, they're level 11. I'll leave Gumble in for a minute. I wish he wasn't hurt. Should have Lickerita up here, Pikachu or something, but it is what it is. These guys actually aren't very high level compared to the people I was just fighting, so that's kind of nice.
All right, we're gonna get Gumball out of here now. And let's go to punish that. Keep scratching away, cause Straw Million's not strong against anything. That's my one bit of advice. You ever play this game? Don't pick Straw Million as your Straw Man as your starter. This typing just sucks against all the bug types you face early on. And even the gym, it's not good against. Final and quick attack. Fuck yeah. Um, tackle, growl, leer. I'm gonna play this weird, but we're gonna put quick attack over tackle. I'm gonna keep growl and leer just in case I need him. A lot of double battles uh, suddenly make growl and leer instead of being totally useless moves. They kind of give him a purpose, and it's part of the reason I was able to beat uh, Barrel both times we took him on in the gym. So I'm actually gonna try to hang on to growl and leer for now because it makes more useless Pokemon. Like if Orange Shock isn't doing any damage or anything like that, I can growl and leer, and it really helped turn the battle around. Um, we're gonna check out those new Pokemon we just caught. M Minta Knight and Q Pop. Those two right there. See if we have any that we want to add to the team. It would be dope if one of them was strong against Barrel's Gym, because then I could go back and train them up on Barrel's Gym and have them put in work. But it is what it is. Sprites or something else, man. All right, Q Pop, what do you got? Old Nature. Rockhead ability prevents recoil damage. That can be useful. He knows Growl and Tailwag. No way to do damage for old Q-Pop. All right, that's going to be a rough one to start with. I'll tell you that much. Wait, what type was he? Was he Grape? He is Grape. Okay. Cherry and Lime. Do we have a Cherry type? We definitely have Lime covered with Chikorita. Shell Armor blocks critical hits. That's nice. It was Bubble. All right, so I think I'm leaving Mennonite out. And I'm kind of covered with Mennonite, because we got we kind of got this new Pokemon that we just put on the team, the berry thing. Um, I want to see what Q-Pop can do, but Q-Pop can't do damage yet. Teach Lickerita Bullet Bit. I think I might. Instead of sitting on it forever, which is what I normally do with moves. I can't, I, I'm interested to put Q-Pop on the team to see if Q-Pop learns any attacking moves kind of soon. It can be useful. I kind of want to keep that level 10 Meowfin around, too. He's kind of, he's bailed me out more than once. But we are going to keep cycling the team around. I might leave Meowfin on the squad. Hey, Yanni. You pops holding, an, holding a lollipop as an item. Uh, I bet it makes... I'm just going to assume it makes him stronger. We can look for sure. But I'm just going to assume it's something that he hangs on that makes him stronger. A grape lollipop to be held by Q-Pop or Lollywhack raises the attack stat. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to give that back to him. I have so many Pokemon, I just need to level up, though. I think... I hate grinding this early on, but if I want to kind of experiment with these Pokemon and see what's up without just getting my ass kicked 24-7 by trainers... I think this is the play. We're going to get Thundershat, Lickerita, and Straw Million further ahead while leveling up Trying to level up Gumball and Q-Pop. I don't know, because the wild Pokemon are so weak. This is the problem. Because the wild Pokemon are so weak out here that this whole switching technique doesn't exactly work. I guess Gumball can fuck up other Gumballs that, in this area. That kind of works out okay. Q-Pop, I'm going to have to level up basically just by uh, double battles, which is fine because every battle is a double battle in this game, which I didn't expect. Wasn't really re ready for that. Yeah, I'm gonna look for other gumballs. 